Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. I am back in Jerusalem after a couple of days adventuring in the south of Israel as I was adventuring the week before last, I think, in the north of Israel. The beauty of Israel is that it's such a small country that you can get pretty much to the far reach of it in two or three hours at most by car if you're interested in where I went do check out some of the recent videos I've uploaded here uh, however for this video today I wanted to do something a little bit different during my recent uh, time driving around Israel I have been listening to a podcast produced by a guy that I've been following on Twitter for I want to say like three months now and you know when you interact with people on Twitter you begin to feel like you sort of know them so I feel like I knew the guy before he produced the podcast even though I've never met him probably never will but it's a really good podcast and given that we are all currently many of us uh, supporters of Israel both those living in Israel and those living in the Jewish diaspora are concerned by what we're seeing on the political front and I think that David Horowitz of the Times of Israel put it best recently when he said that it's not the any specific change that is concerning it's the rapidity of the changes that is quite scary and how quickly Israel is moving away from one direction towards another direction. Now, before recommending this podcast, firstly, I'm recommending this podcast because I'm trying to use my YouTube platform to promote it because I think it's a great podcast. I have no incentive to do so whatsoever. Secondly, because I appear to be today at least a technological dinosaur and I haven't figured out any other way to leave a review for the podcast. So I said instead I would do a video. It's called Israel Explained by Shai L. Ben Ephraim and you can find it on Spotify, you can find it on Apple Podcasts, wherever you're most accustomed to get your podcasts, uh, you should be able to track it down. Again, it's called Israel Explained, so look for those keywords. There's been about eight episodes produced so far and what I appreciate about the podcast is that it's very informative and well researched and I feel like there's probably, you can say that for about 10 percent of podcasts at best he does a really good job now just to explain uh his bias my bias is leaning against these proposed judicial reforms and that probably puts us both towards the left of the political spectrum so if you're on the right of the political political spectrum and you think these proposed judicial reforms in Israel are the best thing under the sun and Israel is going in a wonderful direction you're probably going to be annoyed by the podcast so therefore I'd recommend maybe just not listening because who wants to be annoyed when you're trying to drive there's already enough stress on the roads right but uh, if you are concerned and you're looking for an informative update I highly recommend in particular uh, the episodes regarding what the judicial reform proposals entail there's a good one recently about the potential effects some would say the actual effects these have on Israel's international credit rating via V agencies like Standards & Poor and Moody's and how that might affect uh, the ability of Israel's high-tech powerhouse to raise capital on international uh, capital markets. That's a great episode too. Actually, all the episodes were great. Who is Shia ben Ephraim besides a dude I follow on Twitter? From the best of my knowledge, he's a former Israeli diplomat. I think he has let that nugget out uh, at least once. He lives on the west coast of the US. He's originally from Israel. And that's about as much I know about the guy. Um, I do enjoy his takes on Twitter. He can be followed on Twitter. But as I am not Shai al ben Ephraim, and it's not my job to promote him, um, I'm not even going to give his handle because I can't remember it. However, I do remember his podcast. It's called Israel Explained. I personally think this is one of the best podcasts I've listened to. Um, I think it's highly informative. And I think that if you're trying to just make sense of what's going on at the moment with all these changes in the Israel, the Israeli politics, the rise of the right wing, very far right wing government, um, and all the implications of the judicial reform proposals, really recommend tuning in. It's about 40 minutes per episode. And whether you're at the gym or on the road, or you just want to listen to the episode as you stare out into Jerusalem and Tel Aviv and wonder what's going to be about this place, uh, 
recommended. Thanks for watching. And if you do have other podcast recommendations, book recommendations, YouTube channel recommendations, you'd like to throw back in my direction, feel free to leave them in the comments. I'd appreciate it because I think we all need to be and stay informed, those of us who care about Israel during this very volatile period in Israel's uh, existence as a young country. Thanks for watching. And of course, if you do want to get more videos about Israel and Jerusalem and other such matters, subscribe to this YouTube channel as well as Shayel's podcast. Have a great day.